Sevilla come into this second leg brimming with confidence following what turned out to be a truly convincing win last time out. A performance for which they were rightly lauded. Of course, there were the customary voices about exercising caution when their boss faced the press last night, but the general feeling seems to be that the job is more or less done, a mood that is clearly reflected in the atmosphere here. This place simply a monument to the game. So much prestige, so much pride, so much passion whenever football is played here. So raring to go here, eager to finish the job and move on. Yeah, it's going to take a, a momentous change in fortune to overturn this. I think when you're in such a, a commanding position, there's no need to go chasing goals again here. They've afforded themselves a chance to control the tempo of this second leg and, and make the opposition come up with, with something a little more special. They could end up nibbling at a carcass if they play this right. It's the whistle. Sevilla right here having won their home leg. And look, well placed to progress based on what we know already. Gomez. Acuna goes for a sweeping cross. Chooses to go back. And here's Gomez. And here's... Hits one! Yes, it's in! What a great finish, but how about the touch? It just allowed him to put the ball exactly where he wanted it, and the rest became a formality. Sevilla have made their breakthrough, so can they build on it? Catherine tries to get it forward quickly. Plays it out to the flank. Lovely feet. Played into the... Massive leap! Delivery, but no joy. Sevilla can defend those situations better by stopping the crosser at source. It's a busy front line, uh, lots of movement. And is that working for you? Well... Not really, to be honest, I, I'm not a great fan of taking goal potential away from the penalty box. Dinamo's... It's bounced out! That's a pop! Oh, denied brilliantly! Oh, that's a sparkling save, absolutely sparkling. His reflexes were ultra-sharp. Ocampos... Lucas Ocampos! And he's there to make a great save. Well, that was high-class goalkeeping there to back up his, his high-class wage. Crunching tackle. out wide now goes for goal Gomez has a hit oh real danger here in for the pieces it's being played forward 
Gets on the end of it, and the shot! Acuna. There has been just the early goal here, and the score is 1-0. And here's Gomez. Munir. And the finish! Oh, that is asking for trouble. Turns and goes back. Defending, albeit from an unexpected source. I think it's great to see that kind of application and desire from a forward who wants to help out his defence. I, I think, you know, any good team, really, your striker should be the first line of that defence, and, and he's delivering. Shoots! Forward it goes. Dashing forward at pace. And it's Munir. Just brushed off the ball there. He's there to a real chance! There are a few waiting for it. Shapes to shoot! And that's it for the first half, a breathless ending. So there you have it, a close sport half of football, but one that still had its moments, but ultimately produced just one goal. It was a decent game up to now. Well, you obviously have to give credit to the front end for the half-time lead, but I think the midfield can really pat themselves on the back too. They work tirelessly for me. Sevilla head into the dressing room, pleased with the thought that they have that all-important lead. Analysis to come during the break. And we're already back on the way here. Sevilla going well here, and they're in a good position to kick on and add to their lead. They don't have to overcommit but they can place more emphasis on stretching their advantage without necessarily neglecting things defensively. Ocampos, great strength, too strong for his opponent. He's in! Tries a shot! Well, you know, thinking about that, I think they've perfected that on the training ground because it took them seconds to get the ball from back to front and they really commit forward in numbers too. It was all very well drilled. So, is this the start of a comeback? Rakitic. Acuna is on the end of some really unwanted attention. Well, there's certainly a, a coordinated attempt to shut him down, which is, I suppose, a natural response. Towering header! That's a half-decent try. Munir did give it a fair old crack, and he'll be encouraged to step up again. Tried to play it through. Oh, Peter, his body shape was a giveaway before he made the pass, and its obviousness was, was appreciated. to locate someone up front. Rakitic. And it's Ocampos. Oh, great, goes for goal! More pressure on the opposition goal. They're just lacking the cutting edge, Peter, and while that's fairly obvious, the rest of their attacking play is actually quite good. Sevilla are able now to make their substitution. It's been on the cards for uh, a few moments now.
And here's Gomez. Oh, shooting chance! And that's caused a worry or two. Checks on the touchline, a change about to occur. Gets his head to it! No, he didn't quite meet it right. And back to the keeper. Fernando. And it's Gomez. And he's there to hoof it away. That's just very well played. He can't hurt you with his back to goal, and he didn't go for the back heel. Katarine. Goalkeeper's ball. And it's Gomez. And it's been taken straight back. Hoists it forward. Chance to break. Swift, incisive, deadly, all done in a matter of seconds. That's just brilliant counter-attacking football, and as soon as possession was theirs, it triggered a move of devastating speed that was just too hot to handle. The changes then in quick succession. Well, he's worked so hard for his side, uh, as you would expect, but you couldn't help notice that he was starting to, to labour a bit, so it's no surprise. This is threatening to become a really good game. I think they've done so well to get back in it, but it's important now that they don't become over-eager in chasing another. Great leap! He's pulled off a fine save. Well, what can I say? Truly wonderful goalkeeper. Sevilla can afford to settle on seeing this one out by running down the clock, I think. And it's played forward. Gets up to head it! He will be livid with himself. Dinamo Zagreb are really pouncing on any straight passes in midfield. We're talking seconds from interception to the back of the net. It's counter-attacking heaven. Sevilla cannot hold on to that aggregate lead, and things are starting to look ominous. That's a decent ball. He gets past it, and they've been caught out here. Good take, and the shot! Oh, that's incredible! And that may just do it!
Oh, what a cracking goal, but a cracking touch as well. That's what made it for me. That's brilliant play all round. Sevilla, and the referee brings it to a close. Sevilla are through. Well, considering what happened in the first game, Jim, what do you think they've done here? Well, they did all their good work in the first leg and knew that protection.